If you've tried using a weight in a React component, you know it's not very effective. But in Svelte, it's about to get really easy. Now in React, you have a few options. You can await data in a server component, or on the client, you can install a library like TanStack Query. But in Svelte, we want something that works server and client side with zero libraries. Let's say we're building a hmm. file search widget where we have an input query tracked as state and we want to update the list of files when it changes. Now, if it's async, you need some gnarly code. We would create our state and then write an effect that runs whenever the search changes to get the files and reassign it. It's not terrible, but definitely noisy. What if it looked like this? Just await get files and rerun it whenever search changes by using derived. Simple. And that's not promise.all. If you have multiple values that depend on the same search query, they'll rerun in parallel without you having to think about it and handle loading states, you have this nice concept called a boundary, where you can render custom UI for pending or failure states. Now, this is experimental, but I promise it's worth checking out. I do weekly videos to so subscribe to